This is me, Muhammad. But most of my friends call me Mo. Day to day, everything has been the same. Same crowd, same habits, same old drama. It seems to me that my life has lost all its meaning. I used to get thrills from car hopping, shoplifting from the mall, drinking, and partying through a night with no cares for tomorrow. My so-called friends slowly pulled me into the world of selfishness and desire. Is this the path in which I should follow? Is this what life is all about? Taxi service. Yeah, I'm gonna need a ride. For, uh, I'm at Cliff Edge and Rock Chapel. Yeah, 15 minutes. All right, that's that's fine. All right, thanks. Right. It seems, to me at least, that everyone in the world has lost their sense of fidelity, friendship, and loyalty. My closest friends in high school are all bad news. I was only their friends when it came to their recreation. I've been caught up in all the messes they dragged me into. And now, on top of that, the girl whom I gave all my heart to cheated on me. My family is too ashamed to look at me. My friends are as fake as can be when it comes to their own desires. And my girl showed where her true loyalty was when she cheated on me. I'm alone in this world. Is there no true loyalty left in life? Where do you want to go today? Uh, just take me anywhere. Anywhere? What is everywhere? Where do you want to go? Man. I don't know. Where do you want to go? Man, we can get, get me out of here. Then. Out of here? Okay, man. That's not that wrong. is okay with me. What's your name? My name. <laughs> you want to know my name? <laughs> my name. It is Sheikh Yalafi Tafi. So, what do you say your name is? Mo Gucci, man. Mo Gucci. Is that short for anything or is it a. Uh, your real name? I don't know, man. I, it might be Muhammad. I don't know. It okay. might be Muhammad. Why okay. you look so sad, y'all? Oh, man. This is his friend, D. Your friend, man. Tell me about friends, man. I have this one friend. His name is Bakar Khan. He thinks his beard is better than mine, but mine is so first class. Anyways, we were chilling one day, and I invited him to go drink some lassi, watch Kuch Kuch Hota, and you know, play some cricket, maybe. 
But guess what, man? Guess what? This boy, he faked. He faked on me. Can you believe it? Tell me about it. Right? Tell me about it. This yeah. is not good. Nobody knows. No loyalty, man. But I tell you what, man. Loyalty, I can find it with my Muslim brothers and sisters. So we pray, we pray side to side, shoulder to shoulder, feet to feet. If that's not loyalty, if that's not brotherhood, you, I cannot, you, I don't, I can't even think it. What? Oh snap! It is time to pray. For everything, man. This is the group, man. I think good everything. Oh, this is gonna be wild. conversation in a way that gave everyone something to think about. Thank you. Um, I'm a little concerned about some of the things that you shared, though, in terms of loyalty. I was hoping uh, I can ask you what you learned from it and uh, kind of fill in any gaps. Yeah, I mean, I guess uh, I learned I should be getting with new type of friends, like more different crowd, whatever I hang out with. I, mean, I guess the crowd I hang out with right now is not what I need. Brothers like you and Sheikh, Lafi Tafi. Lafi Tafi, of course. They need Great brothers. Well, this loyalty question you're going to be faced with in your entire life. You're going to be faced with it internally and externally. I mean, the fact of the ma matter is that you live in America, kind of like how we mentioned in the Holocaust. Yeah. And for the most part, it's a non-Muslim society. And part of your identity as a Muslim is, of course, the loyalty to Allah, His Messenger, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, your family, and so forth. There's another sense of loyalty in terms of your citizenship here in the States. This is important, and you'll be faced with this as you grow up, and you learn more about Islam. You'll be confronted with different paths. And what's important is that you remember that other loyalty in order to take the right path. And that's why we always pray to Allah Subhanahu wa ta'ala to guide us on the Sarat al Mustaqim, the straight path. Thank you so much. No problem. Okay.